Hey everyone, what's happening? So for today's video, what we're going to talk about is two different overdrive pedals. Now I was thinking, I said, hmm, this week is, this Friday's Black Friday, holidays are coming up, and maybe you want to recommend someone to get you a new pedal for the holidays, who knows. Uh, but anyway, I thought I'd take two pedals that I really like and give you a brief comparison about them so you can think about it. Maybe that's something you want to uh, purchase. So the two pedals we decided to go with is the Nobel's ODR-1 Natural Overdrive and PRS's Horsemeat Transparent Overdrive. So those are the two pedals we're going to talk about today. So on the ODR-1, you have the drive, the spectrum, and the level. So you basically have three different controls. But when you get into the horse meat, you have the level, the voice, treble, bass, and gain. So you have five different controls there. The one control I like a lot is obviously the, uh, the bass and the treble. And of course the gain. I do like the gain on this particular pedal as well. So with that being said, I've already set up the pedals and I try to get them as close to the same volume as I could. And I put them on settings that I like. So it's kind of speculative or... It's based on what I feel for the pedals and how they sound. So based on that is what I've got set up. And what I'm just going to do is go through some tones for you so you can hear them. And then you can be the judge on how you like it or, or don't like them. So with that, let's get started. So what I think I'll do is I will start off with just maybe a couple chords, a couple just simple chords um, so you can hear that and then I'll go into just a little bit of of lead type stuff for some licks and we'll start off with the ODR1 Switch to the horse meat. Back to the ODR one. And back to the horse meat. ODR1 
horse meat. Back to ODR1. To the horse meat. ODR1. Horse meat. So here are my thoughts. So first of all, both pedals I think are phenomenal. I like them both. I like the sound of the overdrive in both cases. I do like the controls a little bit better that I have on the PRS, having that bass and treble. I like that a lot better. But uh, for the cost, I would be happy with either one. The ODR-1 at time of filming is $119, and the uh, PRS, the horse meat, is $249. So there's a big difference in cost. So... It all depends on what your budget is and what you liked better and the sound that you heard. Well, at that, I want to thank you for watching the video. And if you found it entertaining or gave you some kind of insight into a couple different overdrives, uh, please, if you would, like and, of course, subscribe and uh, leave a comment down there on the video what you thought, what I could do better. Uh, doesn't matter what you tell me, good, bad, or indifferent. I appreciate everything. So... Thanks for watching the video and we'll see you soon.